Hey, hello guys. I wanted to make a video today in, in English for those that do not understand Spanish. Uh, sadly, yesterday I was testing the Honey Badger audio amplifier. This is my uh, YouTube page, uh, Vargas Mongo 34, 35, 34, 35. So I was testing the am amplifier yesterday. I was uh, able to adjust successfully the bias adjustment to about a uh, 40 millivolts because I. Uh, I'm so stupid that I forgot that I do not have a proper heat scene. So I do have the image of the the audio amplifier. As you can see right here. I just using a a, a plate, basically just a, a a plain piece of aluminum. Okay, actually it did work, but uh, I was listening. I was okay here in Puerto Rico. Uh, the temperature was it was so hot yesterday. I think it was like 86 probably maybe more than the humidity what it was so hot yesterday and I, I think I choose a really bad day to test the this audio amplifier but I, at, le at least I was able to adjust the bias correctly the offset I think I did not see any more than I think it was 0, 0.00 something uh, the offset uh, of the output so I was able to adjust it correctly, but I was so stupid that I adjust the bias to <clears throat> 40 millivolts. So that's too high for this application because I do not have the proper heat scene to cool, uh, cool down those uh, devices. Also, these devices they are they were used, so uh, it was not a really a sad story. I just need to work more, um, be be more careful about this. Uh, anyway, uh, I just want to say that. Even uh, even if I have this piece of aluminum, even all the insulation was gray. I used a little thermal compound. You can see that even though these are uh, rubber uh, uh, insulators, I I, I I also use a little uh, uh, heat sink compound, the white uh, grease. So I use it to cool down those devices. So I, I need to be more careful about this. Um, that's why I, I say on my uh, on my. YouTube channel that if someone can help me out, uh, uh, donate to my uh, to my channel at least. Uh, I mean, you don't have to give me a lot of money. I mean, you can you can donate to my channel so I can continue doing this this my studies on electronics. Uh, this is really sad, man. I mean, it's it's sad, but not that sad because I, I actually those uh, transistors. It's from the save, uh, save uh, an old car audio amplifier, and uh, luckily I took those devices out from the uh, that, that broken uh, car amplifier. So I was able to take all those transistors and measure them. Then I make I was making sure that they were right. I mean correct. Um, they were uh, they all good. So I just used them to the first test. And the sound of this amplifier was pretty good. I was I was amazed. It was really quiet. I didn't hear any hum, and um, the sound was pretty good. But I, I was not able to turn on the volume the volume uh, too high, and I forgot. I just spent like 20 minutes listening to some nice music from the 80s and 90s, so I forgot. So that's why it blow up all the actually all the fuses so it, it was really sad i'm uploading a video but it's in, in in spanish so later on i will make another one in english for you guys so you guys can see i mean anyway anyway at least i already tried it's, it's uh, operational it was working nice and i do have the image uh, i think the videos i do have the videos let me see if i can play one for you guys so you guys can see the what happened with the fuses <laughs> It was really sad, man. Okay, this is the video. Okay, ah, uh, okay. I don't understand why I was. I, tr I was trying to figure out what was wrong with the, with the amplifier that it blows the fuses. So I did not think about okay, if the amplifier blew the fuses, that means that all power transistors they blow up. And I was reading here, but sorry about that. I was reading. Uh, about semiconductor failure on this uh, what causes semiconductor devices to fail the thermal overstress okay I uh, was playing music for a while it was a really hot day here in Puerto Rico really hot day 
and I uh, was playing music for about more than I think it was more it was more than 20 minutes more than 20 minutes and then I uh, was trying I was touching the that piece of aluminum it was so hard that I cannot I cannot keep my hand into uh, touching that that metal for more than 30 seconds so I'll be like I'm stupid <laughs> Why you keep playing music with this thing is so hard? Is this is not a heat scene? This is just a piece of aluminum plate. So I did not think about that. So uh, that's my fault. I should not do that anymore. So I this is okay. This is a good thing. So I'm learning that you should not uh, test an amplifier with just a piece of aluminum. Uh, like this plate, uh, this is uh, a flat plate of aluminum. It's not even that thick. It's a thing. It's a, p a thin piece of aluminum, and I should not uh, do that. Do this anymore. So anyway, I think I have the the footage footage of when the fuses. I was trying to figure out what was wrong with the amplifier. I'm so stupid that I did not realize. Okay, it. The amplifier is blowing, is blowing the fuses because all the output transistors they are short out. So that's the reason uh, the fuses they blow out. Okay, this here, right here, thermal overstress. Uh, I'm reading from this uh, website. Okay, thermal overstress. Excess of heat can cause semiconductor to fail. Duh! Excess heat melts materials, charged plastics. Warps and breaks semiconductor dies and causes other type of damages. In general, devices should not operate with the junction temperature above above 125 uh, sla uh, you know 150 degrees. So yeah, that thing was so hot yesterday. That that makes sense. Makes sense. I will not do that anymore. So. Uh, maybe I'm gonna purchase the the other transistors. I'm gonna purchase the transistor, but I don't have a heat sink anyway, so it's nothing I can do about it. So that's why I say on my uh, YouTube channel, if someone can help me out, please, <laughs> so I can continue doing this, cause uh, uh, it's right here the link. I don't think nobody's seeing the link. Donate now. I mean, this is really stressful, man. Yeah, like the semiconductors, they blow, they blow up. I mean, you can donate 50 cents, one dollar, whatever you can, so I can continue doing my studies. And uh, yeah, that's this is my PayPal account, so you can donate something. Uh, don't mind about the misspell the last audio and electronic design, so I misspell this last word. Don't worry, don't worry about that. It's, you know, English is my second language, so anyway. So yeah, it was really stressful. It's really stressful not to have the uh, proper heat sink. Uh, I think uh, I had to give a break. I take a break of, about this. Take a break and uh, until I I can get a correct uh, heat sink, so I can at least I have more boards. I have I had I think I have three more extra boards so I can populate the board with the components. So I can I can build another one with. I gotta be more careful this time. I got, but at least, at least I was playing music for a while. Uh, you can see I had the RCA uh, right there, so it, it was really nice. I mean, it, it, it was worth it, worth it, worth it. Did I say that right? Worth it to worth. It was what? Yeah, I don't worry about that. That's a difficult word to pronounce. It was nice. I mean, it was nice. I was listening to music for for a while. And it was. It sounds. It sounded really nice. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you the video. I think I had the video. I was talking something in Spanish, and <laughs> all right. Bueno, amigo, estoy intentando. Parece que estaba mente de transistor. Okay, ah, uh, you can see here. Que se encarga de la vía, se vaya. Okay, I, you can see here these uh these resistor that you see in the image right here. Those are sacrificial resistor. They are not. They don't need to be there. So I just uh, they burn out because uh of the short because of the short out of the of the these transistors. So. So let me see, let me... So, se quemaron los fusibles y... Okay, gratis. Okay. Vamos a ver si... Lo que pasa es que hoy está haciendo mucha calor en Puerto Rico. Uh, I was saying that uh, today, uh, it was, yeah, man, that was yesterday, but today it was really hot, it was a, a really hot day to test out this amplifier. Puerto Rico, so esto que estoy haciendo ahora es arriesgado. I'm saying that this is a, this is a risky uh, procedure. 
Vamos a ver si funciona. Yo sé que se quemaron eso. Yo espero que no sea un, un, un grave daño. So I was saying that I hope it was that. that it was, I hope it's not a really uh, uh, big uh, uh, problem or something like that. But I did not realize that, okay, it makes sense that the uh, output transistor, they, they short out. So I did not realize that. Because uh, when you, something happened to you, you, you don't think. You, your your mind is like block you you, uh, you got a block mind so le you you will see the the sparks on the fuse and this led they were turned on just for a few seconds and i'm about to turn uh to, to connect the the power le le i always show you right now let me let me take the audio off because uh, you don't think you know oh, let me see oh yeah yeah that thing is better if i there you go check it out check it out now I'm about to play music so I can turn on the amplifier and you will see the, the, those fuses to blow up. I was saying, oh, that piece of aluminum, it was so hot. Oh, Mr. Vargas, do you realize that? That is so hot. You should not test the amplifier with a hot weather. Listen, look, look. There you go. I'm so stupid. Anyway, anyway, at least I know that amplifier works works really good. So that yeah, the only thing I gotta do is just replace those uh, output transistor. Uh, today I just started out to take all the screws so I can remove those uh, damaged transistors. So I gotta clean all that out and then to install new transistors. Uh, so well, let me see if I can I can do something about it. I mean, find out a piece of aluminum so I can screw it to the to that plate to dissipate that heat so i can test it out better oh my god this is so stressful <laughs> all right guys i just wanted to make a video in english for you guys to so to explain you what is going on with the uh, honey badger chrome and sadly things happen you know so anyway i i was thinking that those devices they were not that good at all because uh, i i was seeing the specs on the on them uh, i don't think they were that good at all so probably that's the also, also the reason why they burn out so so quickly uh, because uh, I, uh the transistor that i always use are these let me sh let me show you guys are these transistors this is really important oh yeah this is really important oh chernobyl okay let's let me show you so These are really good transistor for all the applications. So, okay, there you go. Uh huh, right here. These are a really good transistor. So, MJL3281 and um, MJ. L132A PMP exceptional safe operational area, uh, excellent gain li linearity. You know, so line linearity. <laughs> I, don't know how, I don't know how to pronounce that word. Sorry about that, guys. High frequency. These devices are okay. Whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, reliable performance at high powers. Symmetrical characteristics. Complementary configuration. Accurate reproduction of input signal. Great dynamic range, high amplifier bandwidth, application, high-end consumer audio products, home re amplifiers, home receivers, professional audio amplifier, theater and stadium sound system, public address systems, PAs. So these are the ones that I, I think are gonna are gonna get me this. And you can see this is uh, 200 watt devices. So the other one, I think they were less. I think they were like a 125 watts. So and the heat. Uh, let me see about the heat okay this is it says sorry about that operation and storage junction temperature range so we got plus 150 150 i was reading the thing about the the temperature thing about the let me see go back i gotta go back now see hundred and fifty yep I think that those that play it was so hard man it was so hard I think that that's the reason they, they just died they just gave up they say like fuck it I'm gonna die right here I'm gonna make mr. Vargas miserable and fuck you Vargas I'm gonna die here right now fuck your video 
That's <laughs> it. I was making the video, man. I, to be honest, I was a little scared because I mean that 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 shit that, that's gonna burn. That thing is gonna burn out, man. This, uh, that's not a hick scene. That's a piece of aluminum, man. All right, guys. That's it. I just wanted to make a bit in English for you guys, for those that do not understand English or comprehend the language, the Spanish language. All right, guys. Have a good day. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, give a like to this video and share. Anyway, I'm not an expert, professional. I do not have expensive tools and stuff like that. All right, guys. Have a good day. Anyway, you know. What, what you can do?